Lamar D. Fane College of Fine Arts. Robert Horvath. When Robert Horvath thinks of Midwestern State University, he remembers how invested his professors were in his success. His professors were his mentors, and they gave him a strong foundation to continue on to graduate school, and later he would become a teacher himself. He had an amazing group of friends at MSU and remembers their studios being well maintained and their gallery exhibitions being of the highest caliber. He credits Elizabeth Yaros for being someone who influenced his life and career. Robert was born on November 29, 1974, in Nitra, Slovak Republic, the son of Arpad Horvath and Maria Horvath. He has an older brother who attended Comenius University in Bratislava, Slovakia, and a younger brother who attended seminary, also in Bratislava, Slovakia. Robert came from Eastern Europe soon after the fall of communism in the early 1990s. Robert is single but has two furry children Bebo, a 13 year old soft coated Wheaton Terrier, and Bogey, a six year old Labradoodle. Robert earned his Bachelor of Fine Arts from MSU in 1999 and earned his Master of Fine Arts from the University of Illinois in 2002. As an associate professor of painting at the Heron School of Fine Art and Design at Indiana University, Purdue University, Indianapolis since 2014, he is now influencing other art students. Most notable to Robert were three professors Elizabeth Yaros, Richard Ash and Gary Goldberg. More than just a painting professor, Liz was a mentor, and Robert feels he owes a lot of his success to her. Richard Ash was his printmaking professor and had very high expectations for quality of work and studio maintenance. He still strives to be as neat and organized as Richard. Robert took Gary Goldberg's graphic design class his first year. He had no idea what to expect from a university and felt that Professor Goldberg was understanding and offered a lot of guidance. While at MSU, Robert was a member of the International Student Organization, and most of his activities were centered around the art department. He was a student assistant for Elizabeth Yaros and for Richard Ash. Robert's closest friend, Jason Reynaga, also studied art at MSU. He was there for him in good times and bad times, and Robert says he couldn't have done it without Jason. He also had friends who became his family while living far away from home Joe and Betty Kosarek, Sandy and Bob Goff, Brenda and Tony Chaliwa, and the crew of the bike stop, Katie Katz, Jane Spears, Pat Nelson, and Kathy Morrison are among many other friends he made in Wichita Falls. In his artist statement, Horvath asks, With our attention being pulled in so many directions by media oversaturation and the cult of celebrity, our society seems to turn its assessing eye further and further inward and away from the darkness of the world's problems. Is this candy land we have created a beautiful barrage of harmless luxury, or will this insidious viral nature lead to our extinction? He uses a technique of glazing in multi layers to create a luscious candy colored sweetness in the surface of the works. This colorful sweetness entices participation by the viewer, making palpable the viral cloud menace as it influences the libidinous scene. In recent years, Robert has developed a fascination with the complex nature of Rococo porcelain. This work is a series of paintings and digital compositions that incorporate homoerotic imagery into the Rococo style, transforming it into a contemporary idiom. These artworks advance a dialogue that breaks free of historical strictures. Robert's most recent grants and fellowships include the New Frontiers Creativity and Scholarship Grant, Indiana University in 2017. As well as Indianapolis Art Council Creative Renewal Grant in 2015. His latest solo exhibitions include the 2017 Petite Mort Sabbatical Exhibition, Basile Gallery, IUPUI, Heron School of Art and Design in Indianapolis, Indiana, White Gold, 
Burt Green Fine Art Gallery with Aaron Packer Projects in Chicago, Illinois. 2014 Excitotoxisms Packer Shop Gallery, Chicago, Illinois. In 2015, his group exhibitions included Finders Keepers, Supernatural, Hoosiers Salon vs. Indiana Museum of Contemporary Art, and many more. Robert has been featured in presentations, workshops, lectures, and visiting artists, most recently at Hanover College, and also in 2006 at Midwestern State University. He has been featured in multiple editions of New American Paintings, juried exhibitions in print. As a visual artist, Robert began a two-and-a-half-month backpacking trip, which refueled and invigorated him. His travel began in Dubai, exploring new landscapes and old-world remnants. During the next four weeks, he made his way through the northern regions of India, with stops in Rajasthan and at the Ajanta and Ellora Caves, which are UNESCO World Heritage Sites. He traveled through Mumbai and moved on to Vietnam, Cambodia, and Thailand. The opportunities that emerged from his journey refueled him for the classroom and the studio and helped make connections with other international artists who he hopes to work alongside. Robert feels he needs self-reflection periods that only come when out of his everyday routines. Robert resides in Indianapolis, Indiana with Bebo and Bogey.